really write happy poetry. I don't know why. Um, but this is another not happy one. Sorry. <laughs> there are a million things I wish I had said at my grandmother's funeral, but I only have time for a few. Most people only see their grandparents on holidays and maybe even weekends. But time after time, my young mother would drop me at their house, sometimes just for the night, but often for days or even weeks at a time. And my grandma took me in without complaint. I was at her house so often that she raised me more than her daughter did. I was more like her child than her grandchild, too. If she hadn't been in a wheelchair, you would have never known she was sick. She smiled through everything, even the worst pain you could imagine. She is still the strongest person I know because although I don't believe in God or even heaven, I know that somewhere along the way her strength transferred to me. Three, I wish she could see who I am today. She wanted to see me get married, but she didn't even see me graduate middle school. And as I am only five months away from graduating high school, I wish I could tell her all that has happened. Show her my success, talk through my failures. But now, almost four years later, I am alive. And she lives through me. Woo!